deputy speaker and make her immediate. On Friday, the actions of Speaker Amini Wazir Tambua, who on Thursday, 19th of February, directed the Joint House Committees on Rules and Business, Judiciary and Justice to advise the House on the motion. The House approved a clause 9 empowering the INEC chairman to request Mr. President to deploy the military in appropriate circumstances on election duty. During the debate for the deployment of the military for elections, Representative Sunday, the Speaker, and the is in court. Representative Dr. Bill Miller demanded for evidence. The objection raised by Honorable Karimi was that the case was pending in court. And that is what was referred to the committee. Now we have the Chairman of Business and Rules actually debating. In the presentation by the Chairman of Committee on Rules and Business, in his own words, captures the decision of these committees. I therefore am guided to sustain this order. Honorable Sam Sokwa abandoned his terms of reference and decided to take the debate and rule on the entire merits of the motion. It is unacceptable to us. People should learn to accept, you know, the rulings of the House because as parliamentarians, we should foster national interest and not personal or partisan interests. The House earlier adopted a motion by Representative Hindu Gay in the room on the urgent need to compel the Office of the Accountant General of the Foundation to cooperate with the House Committee on Health to enable it to work effectively on the Ministry's health budget. The House is concerned that up to date, the Office of the Accountant General of the Foundation has failed, refused, or neglected to respond to the request of the House Committee on Health. They also recognized one of their own, Mungu Bile Lumelu, who turned 50 recently.